Hey there! This is Patrick here at Green Bicycles Laboratory and I'm going to show you how you can amend your soil with Ocean Bounty Flower Mix. Ocean Bounty is the first step in the Green Bicycles two-step nutrient program. Ocean Bounty is an all-natural carbon-based nutrient good for all stages of plant growth. Once your soil is amended, it will be loaded with nutrients that will last an entire season. We're going to demonstrate three amending methods. Premixing, top dressing, and making a tea. Before we get started, let's go on a local field trip to get an understanding of how green bicycles use plant nutrition. Let's go check out the forest. Isn't this forest beautiful? It's green, healthy, and pristine. It's almost perfect, and nobody fertilizes it. Taken care of only by nature. The sun, air, and rain, and the decaying plants and animals left on the forest floor are the ingredients to this amazing forest. Plants and animals are the nutrients. Plants and animals eat plants and animals. Carbon-based life forms eat carbon-based life forms. It's really that simple. And if you think about it, we've known this for millennia. All cultures eat plants and or animals. Eating things that used to be alive seems to work universally. At Green Bicycles, we developed our plant nutrition philosophy based on a healthy meal. Plants and animals with a little bit of natural salts are on the menu. A tasty meal indeed. Ocean Bounty is made with plant and animal meals, some natural acids and minerals, and some biology. It's a full course meal that won't feed the entire season. Let's head back to the laboratory and I'll show you how to amend Ocean Bounty into your soil. Now I'm going to show you how to fully premix your bagged soils with Ocean Bounty. Most all the common bagged soils have been tested with this mix. From the lightly amended HP Pro Mix to the more heavily amended Fox Farm Ocean Forest, good results have been had. For this batch, we're going to use King's Mix from Royal Gold. The application rate for Ocean Bounty is roughly 30 pounds per yard of soil, or 2 pounds for a 1 to 2 cubic foot bag of soil. The King's Mix comes in a 3 cubic foot bag, so we're going to use 4 pounds, or the equivalent of 8 cups of Ocean Bounty. We'll start out by spreading a bag of soil on a clean tarp. We'll add in our Ocean Bounty and thoroughly mix it using the rake and roll method. Let me show you how we do it. The second two pound of Ocean Bounty. Now we roll. Rake and roll until it's thoroughly mixed. You can't tell the difference between the two. No more streaks. We usually rake and roll three or four times to get it thoroughly mixed. looks fertilely mixed. I don't see any big streaks of the nutrients. So, it, so we're, we're just about finished. Since we won't be using all the soil at this time, 
we're going to store it in a clean can. This will give us the opportunity to enhance our soil mix. We'll add in some actively aerated compost tea to accelerate the soil breakdown, making the nutrients more available. I have a fresh batch of Happy Endings Tea. Let's grab a couple gallons and add it to our soil. Happy Endings Tea is the second step of the Green Bicycles two-step program. Check out our website and videos for more information. Our soil can be used at any time now, but the longer it sits, the richer it gets. The available carbon-based nutrients are natural and they won't burn your plants. Just cover it up and let it sit. If a layer of mycelium forms, that's usually a good sign. This soil can be used for all stages of plant growth. Here's another way you can amend your soil, by top dressing with Ocean Bounty. I'm simply going to spread about a quarter cup around the base of each plant, then rake and water it in. It's probably the easiest way to feed your plants. Now you can just sit back and watch them grow. The final way I'm going to show you how to use Ocean Bounty to feed your plants is by making a liquid nutrient or a tea. We'll simply dissolve the dry powder into water and stir it up. You can kick it up a notch by aerating the solution. So let's start by adding a third of a cup of Ocean Bounty into three gallons of water. At this point, you can stir the solution and apply it to your garden. But Ocean Bounty is not completely water soluble, so top dress your plants with the undissolved remains. To further enhance this nutrient, we can aerate the solution for a couple of hours up to three or four days. For more information on the aeration process, check out our video on Brewing Up Happy Endings Tea Mix. You can find it on our website. So there you have it, three methods for amending your soil with Ocean Bounty Flower Mix. We hope you found this information useful and you're going to try our products. And just remember, Green Bicycles makes your plants pedal faster 